Do people do their foreheads too? Hello guys, welcome back to another video. I actually have my makeup done because I just finished. I just finished filming a TikTok, but guys, things may look appealing, but guess what, babe? Guess what? I'm a hairy beast. I thought that I could really, you know, push it out, wait it out, wait it out. But the truth is, I have to get to shave it. We are going to shave my face today. I have never shaved my face. Is that how you shove it? I'm never kidding. <laughs> I know it's shaving. I have never shaved in my face ever. So this is gonna be the first time a little derma planning. I am actually going to take off all of my makeup and then we're gonna get to shaving hopefully hopefully we could do this and hopefully we do this right okay The hair is already peeking through, guys. There's so much of it. It's time to get shaving. I've always known, uh, like, shaving your face to get a smoother application with your makeup and just like to brighten your face overall and i was thinking that i really wanted to try it so i was trying to hold out to my birthday the birthday next month girl but i'm like no just in just in case things go south let's try it out now i got two razors from the beauty supply store i have my mirror hair clips optional two face serums. They say that the best way to do this is to have your face moisturized with either some sort of oil or like gel. And I don't really wanna waste my CEO Glow oil, so I'm gonna go ahead and use my aloe vera gel. I haven't seen much people use aloe vera, so. My face is completely dry from, um, the wig is crazy. The wig looks crazy, so un momento por favor. Un momento. Yes, por favor. Thank you very much, thank you. So I'm just gonna lather up my face with the aloe vera. My face is pretty much ready to go. These are like eyebrow or facial razors, and they say to just pull your skin like up, but my skin is not pullable. Wait, how do people, why are people doing that? It's not making a difference. Um, oh, oh, okay, and just shave down. So I'm gonna start from the bottom actually. Surprisingly, a lot of hair. Oh, my eyes is burning the aloe vera. Is that supposed to happen? That's surprisingly, uh, oh. I feel like I could see my dark marks more, but we're gonna continue. We're gonna go ahead and continue with this. Just kind of like pull the skin up and go down. <laughs> Things are actually looking a little smoother. I can kind of see a difference. So now I'm gonna go ahead and just go over my mustache really quick. This is something that I always shave my mustache because I'm just hairy. I don't know, I ha definitely have one. And I used to wax my mustache, but that left me with so many bumps, like around my mouth. And I was like, never again. I'm just going to apply a little bit more gel. Kind of slightly pull up and shave. Ah, I 
feel like I look like a naked mole rat a little bit. Okay guys, so this is actually pretty easy and simple. I thought it was gonna be a lot harder to do while I was doing it. I don't know why I thought this was gonna be so difficult, but um, yeah, I'm glad I'm doing this now so I could see if I really wanna add this to my skincare routine as like a regular thing. So um, just once more, you just pull your skin up like this and then shave in a downwards motion that's how i see people get like the smoothest shave um so i'm just gonna go ahead and move this over so you guys can see and this side i used less aloe vera because i felt like i had a little too much at first so yeah i'm so shocked actual hair is coming off like wow people do their foreheads too like my skin looks a lot brighter and smoother it's like the same but just like a little bit smoother so I can't wait to see how my skin is gonna look once I apply my makeup and everything like that I will not be doing that in this video we are just shaving together removing the hair and now that we're doing hair removal um and i'm pretty much done with my face i'm just gonna go ahead and try to pluck underneath my chin because i don't know about you guys but i definitely suffer with i don't want to say suffer because it's not that bad but i definitely have hair that grows underneath my chin and i kind of have to frequently go under and remove it so i like to pluck the hair under my chin i don't know it's a little bit fun is that weird and gross i'm so sorry sorry it's a little bit funner i just use a normal tweezer for plucking the hair underneath my chin Okay guys, so my face is fully shaven, hair free, fully shaved, girl. We are here free. My eyebrows are bushy, but that's okay. We're getting them done soon. I must say my skin feels like really dry. I do have dry skin, so that's, that's normal. So what I'm actually gonna do is I'm gonna put on a face mask for the rest of the night and use an ice roller to really make the serum seep in. And then I will, I don't know, maybe check back in tomorrow to see how my skin looks. I have the Honey face mask. This is the one that I'm gonna be using. This is the Lapcoast Honey nourishing face mask i wanted to use the hyaluronic acid but i felt like because my skin is so dry out right now i should probably use the nourishing one so these are super super nice because they have so much um serum in them Ooh. I definitely keep these masks in the fridge so that they're nice and cold when I put them on because I don't know that's just how I like my masks this should really be all the nourishment I need after that shaving so I'm gonna leave this on for like 20 ish minutes and then I'm just gonna let it seep into my skin and use an ice roller Why is my skin burning please <laughs> I need to know what's going on here the skin, it's burning, especially the forehead. The forehead, I should have used aloe vera on my forehead when I shaved it really quick because I'm starting to feel the tingles. I, I've awoken. It is the next day, it's like evening time now, so, okay. I actually had a big gym sesh today and you guys know I do not do my skincare before the gym, I wait till after. So I got home, took my shower, did what I needed to do, ate, knocked out, girl. It is 5 p.m. at this point. <laughs> I'm about to get into my skincare, but before we started, I wanted to show you guys. So overall, skin, 
smooth, smooth like a baby's blood. It's smooth, okay? But what, what? There's issues, there are issues. I have very sensitive skin, so I don't know if it's because of that. I don't know if it's because, let me stop talking. My skin is pretty reactive on this side of my face. I forgot whatever I did when um, shaving this side. I feel like I used less product on this side to shave my face. So girl, if you are going to shave your face, make sure it's well oiled all around. Well gel down through and through because this area is a little bumpy and I would get similar bumps when I would wax my lips like I would get the same bumps like here but a lot like thicker that's the only downside that I've seen so I'm going to run through my skincare really really quick do it from start to finish moisturize serum cleanse and then just see what it's looking like but so far I love I love the look of my skin right now Sorry, that was close, we were close. Also, sidebar, if this isn't your first video of mine, girl, I need a vlog camera, right? Like, you guys are, we're close, we're very close, I love you, you love me. <laughs> we love each other, but it's just like, I could back up a little, you know? I could zoom out, the crop doesn't have to be so constrained. Um, anyway. And it is a little itchy in the areas that I showed you. It feels just irritated and those are just like irritation bumps, honestly. It's not like any real extreme acne, but it is annoying. So if you can try your best to avoid that, please learn from me. Skincare is done. I am feeling irritation in this area, but I'm just going to treat it like the rest of my skin and continue to do my skincare routine. That usually helps me whenever I have some sort of bumps or whatever trying to come up. I just do my skincare normally, leave it alone, and it's fine. So we're going to follow it, see how it is. Um, make sure you guys subscribe for more videos and in the vlogs to come, you guys will see if I continue to shave my face, put this into my routine. Leave a comment and thumbs up this video if you enjoyed it. I will see you all in my next video, bye.